Hello Alaskans. About a month ago, I witnessed a heartwarming sight as I saw a young dad teach his four-year-old daughter to shake the hand of a soldier and to say thank you. This one act of teaching the next generation to value the service and sacrifice of those who serve, that'll go far towards preserving our freedom. As governor, I had the honor of visiting with many of our service members and their families. I'll never forget my visits with injured troops at the Landstuhl Regional Medical Center in Germany. While there, I listened to several critically wounded warriors talk about their service and what they fought for. I left their bedsides with even greater admiration and greater gratitude for their service, as well as for their hearts of courage and devotion to our country. One warrior, recovering from grave, life-threatening injuries, told me he would, without question, he'd do it all over again to protect the country he loves. That patriotism is a bedrock value shared by veterans who have gone before us and who have selflessly given all for us as a people and for the United States. It's why we pause this Memorial Day to embrace the freedom and the republic they fought for. It's why we honor every day all who have made that ultimate sacrifice. Thank God for them. And on this Memorial Day, let's honor their love of country. We praise our warriors and their families, and we lay a wreath of gratitude for the fallen. God bless America and the great state of Alaska.